The next button on our viewport toolbar is Level Streaming Volume Previs. Now this is a very, very specific button. It's really only going to be useful, one, if you're using level streaming, and two, if you're streaming by way of level streaming volumes. So what I've done is I've set up a really quick example of a level streaming system. So without going too far kind of off topic into how level streaming works, what you've got here is two separate levels. We have a level here on the left and a level on the right. These are both set up in a level streaming system so that when we start the game, we're already sitting in level 1. As we cross the little gantry way, we pass into a level streaming volume, which will stream level 2 into memory so that we can use it. Now here's what this actually looks like while we play. So here we are inside of level 1. If we look across the way, level 2 doesn't exist. Now generally you wouldn't want to set a system up like this. You want to kind of hide it from the player. But for an example, as we pass into that big volume, bink, the second level becomes available. So now we can run around in it. Now watch this. As we start to jump back out, once we clear that volume, once we step out of it, boom, the second level disappears. So really, this is just an optimization system that allows you to stream levels in and out of memory to keep things nice and tidy for really, really big levels. It's just you wouldn't normally want to let the players see you bringing them in and out of existence. Now, that brings us back to the level streaming volume previs button. The purpose of this button is to allow you to preview the way these level streaming volumes are going to work right here inside your viewport. So if I turn that on, notice level 2 disappears until I pass back into that volume and then it appears again. So if we switch off that behavior, the level is always visible if it was visible to begin with. If it's invisible and we switch it off, then it's just going to remain invisible. So that's really all there is to the level streaming volume previs button. It's a very, very specific button, only usable when you're using level streaming and when you're handling level streaming through volumes. And that will wrap things up for this video. Yeah. <laughs>